Hi everybody, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll talk more in detail about our universal charters and how to find the right one for you. If you find this video content helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. We upload a new video every week. Let's get started. So what is a universal charger? You've probably heard of the term before, but what does it actually mean? A universal battery charger is a type of charger that's designed to charge multiple types of battery sizes, such as AA, AAA, CD, or 9 volts. And in addition to that, it can also recharge different chemistries, such as nickel metal cadmium, nickel metal hydride, and lithium-based batteries. However, one thing to note is that even though they're called universal chargers, each one of them has a different range of batteries that it can recharge. And that's why we have multiple types of universal chargers, including our T9688, TN299, TN486U, T4S, and our TN456. Alright, let's dive into the details for each of them. The first one I have here is the T9688 charger. I would call this a standard nickel-based battery charger. It can recharge any AA, AAA, C, D, and 9 volt batteries. So to open the charger, you press the button here. On the inside, there are six independent charging slots in total. These four channels are for AA, AAA, Cs, and Ds. And then these two channels are for 9 volts only. Something to keep in mind for this charger is that you can charge up to two 9 volt batteries and four AA or AAA batteries at the same time. But if you want to charge a C, D, and a 9 volt at the same time, you might need to rearrange it around or charge fewer batteries because the C and D size batteries will cover up the 9 volt slots. This charger has three different charge currents for different types of batteries. It'll charge at 1300 milliamp for AA, Cs, and Ds, at 500 milliamps for AAAs, and at 30 milliamps for 9 volts. Please note that this is the charge current for each channel. For the LCD screen, it will let you know when the battery is charging or discharging, or when it detects a bad battery, such as a defective one or a non-rechargeable one. The D button on the left side stands for the discharge feature. This function can discharge batteries at a rate of 400 milliamps. And then the L button on the right side stands for light, which is to turn on the backlight so you can see better when it's darker. As an extra feature, there is a 5 volt USB port on the back of the charger to recharge your other electronic devices. This function is only ready when there is no battery in the charger when the charging is complete or during discharging. The USB function icon will appear to let you know when you can use it. Next, we have the TN299. This one looks quite similar to the previous T9688. It has the cover lid, two channels for 9 volts, four channels for other battery types, and an LCD showing the battery charging stuff. However, this one doesn't have a discharge function but has a wider compatibility range of batteries. So in addition to NiCADs and nickel metal hydrides, AA, AAA, Cs, Bs, and 9 volts, this charger can also recharge lithium ion or lithium iron phosphates, 18650s, 14500s, or 10400s. This charger has five different charging currents for different types of batteries. It can recharge at 1000 milliamp for AA, Cs, Ds, and at 500 milliamp for AAAs, at 50 milliamp for 9 volts, for lithium-based batteries, if you have one or two pieces inserted in, it'll recharge at 800 milliamps. And if you have three to four pieces inserted, it'll recharge at half the speed, which is 400 milliamps. The button here is for opening the lid. Next to it is the switch to switch between lithium iron and lithium iron phosphate battery types. So if you're charging lithium iron phosphates batteries, be sure to flip the switch Please note that you can't charge both lithium ion and lithium iron phosphates at the same time. You can check out this video to maintain your charger for more details. The next in line here is the TN486U. This charger is also a standard nickel-based charger that is powered by micro USB and USB-C. There are a total of 5 independent charging slots. One channel is for 9 volts, and four channels are for AA, AAA, Cs, and D-sized batteries. 
You can recharge nickel metal hydride and nickel cadmium, AA, AAA, C, D, and nine volt batteries. Again, the C and D size batteries can cover the nine volt charging slot, so keep that in mind when you want to recharge multiple C, Ds, and nine volts. The LCD charger will show the battery status and error messages if the battery is not suitable for the charging, such as if the battery is damaged or if it's a disposable single time use battery. If you have two amps of power coming into the charger, it'll recharge your AA, Cs, and Ds at 600 milliamp. And if you have one amp of power going in, it'll recharge at 450 milliamps. For AAA size and nine volt batteries, the charge current will be the same no matter what the input load is. So it'll recharge those batteries at 300 milliamps for AAA and 35 milliamp for nine volts. The next universal charger we have here is a T4S. Compared to the previous one, this one has the widest range of compatible batteries. Not only can it charge nickel metal cadmium and nickel metal hydride AA, AAA, Cs, and sub C batteries, but also a variety of lithium based batteries such as lithium ion, lithium iron phosphates, and different sizes such as 26650, 22650, or 18650s, and many more. You can also recharge up to four batteries at once. This LED right here shows the power status, and these indicators will let you know the battery charging status. If there's an error, it will blink rapidly. And just like the TN299, this charger has a switch between lithium iron and lithium iron phosphate. You will need to select the type accordingly when charging lithium iron or lithium iron phosphate. So for this charger, if you have 3 to 4 batteries inserted at the same time, it will charge them at 425 milliamp. If you have 1 to 2 batteries inserted to be charged, it will recharge them at 850 milliamps instead. Last but not least is our TN456. This one has a lot more options and give you a lot more flexibility and control over each channel. There are four independent channels in total, and the charger is compatible with nickel metal and cadmium, nickel metal hydrides, AA, AAA, Cs, and sub Cs, and most lithium ion battery sizes, such as 18650, 14500, and 10440. The charger has two modes. One is charging mode and one is testing mode. The testing mode is for those who want to check the battery capacity. Once the mode is selected, it will start discharging the battery to zero and then recharging it back to 100. And the maximum capacity will be displayed on the LCD. This current button will let you select one out of four current charge options to recharge your batteries. You can recharge them at 300 milliamp, 500 milliamp, 700 milliamp, and 1000 milliamp or 1 amp. And you can customize the settings individually by selecting the channel's number. Pressing this display button will let you check accumulated capacity and elapsed time internal resistance. the charge voltage and charging current. And that's all for the universal battery charger topic. We hope that you've uncovered some details that you might find useful in choosing the right charger for you. If you have any comments or video suggestions, feel free to leave them down in the comment section below. And we'll see you next time.